gross. I wish other people would ride their bikes instead of always using cars. Dear Tim and Moby, I don't understand what my teacher means when he asks me to find the main idea. Can you help me? From Gladys. Sure, Gladys. The main idea is just the main point that's being stated in a paragraph, essay, article, or other passage. It's what's specifically being said about a particular topic. The topic of a paragraph or passage is the general subject. Okay, well, say you're reading an article about how cheetahs can run at very high speeds. The topic would be cheetahs, because that's the general subject of the article, cheetahs. And the main idea would be that cheetahs can run fast, because that's the point the article is trying to get across. Details support what the author is trying to say with examples. They're sort of like evidence as to why the main idea is true. The details would explain what makes a cheetah run so fast, how fast it can run, things like that. All right, let's, let's read this paragraph and try to find the main idea. Not only is smoking cigarettes a disgusting and smelly habit, it's also extremely bad for your health. It has been proven to cause cancer, lung disease, and heart disease, and to weaken your immune system. Smoking makes it a lot harder to breathe, which means it's more difficult to play sports and get the exercise you need to stay healthy. It is also harmful for those hanging around a smoker because they breathe the smoky air. Even though most people are aware of how bad smoking is for them, more than 1,000 people die each day from its effects. So first, let's figure out the topic. What would you say the topic is? The general subject that this paragraph is discussing. That's right. The topic is smoking, specifically cigarette smoking. Now, let's try to find the main idea. To find the main idea, ask yourself, what point is the writer trying to make? It's always helpful to skim through the passage again and see what words are repeated and what idea the author is trying to stress or get across. What do you think the main idea is, Moby? Well, the writer is saying that smoking is gross, but more specifically, that smoking is bad for your health. You can tell this from the details in the paragraph, that smoking causes cancer and heart and lung disease, that makes you sick, and that it makes it hard to breathe. Sometimes the main idea will be at the start of a paragraph or article. In the passage we just read, the writer pretty much stated the main idea in the first sentence. But the main idea can be stated anywhere in a piece of text. Sometimes it's in the second or third paragraph, for instance, or sometimes it'll come at the very end as a conclusion. It's not always that clear, though, and sometimes you have to do a little more work to figure it out. One important thing to remember is that sometimes you're going to have to reread the passage and go back to it a few times to get a good sense of what's being discussed. Let's look at the newspaper article that Moby was reading earlier. When we can, it's important to carpool, use public transportation like buses and trains, ride a bike, or walk instead of driving a car. These things release fewer dangerous toxins into the air. You may not realize it, but air pollution is becoming a bigger problem every day. It is terribly damaging to the environment and the air we breathe. For this reason, we should try to cut back on harmful emissions. One of the best ways to reduce pollution is to use methods of transportation that are less harmful to the environment. So what would you say are the topic and main idea in this passage? Right, the topic is air pollution. And the main idea is that driving cars less helps reduce air pollution. Yes, and riding your bike is a good way to do that. Anyway, if you're ever stuck on finding a main idea, it helps to ask yourself general questions about the passage. They can be things like, is it about a person, an idea or a theory, an event? That way you can start by getting a broader idea of what's being discussed. Another helpful thing you do is pretend that someone has asked you what the paragraph or essay is about. If you can give an answer that sums up the passage in just one sentence, you've probably got the main idea. But, but we just got home. Where are we supposed to ride our bikes to? What do you mean we can't stop riding our bikes? I'm not so sure you got the main idea of that article. 